Cascade Sports. I'm Marlo Garlington. We're here at the IEL Fieldhouse for the Thanksgiving Basketball Classic. Right now I have the head coach of Lebec Community College, Jonathan Rainey. How's it going, coach? Not bad, not bad. Survived the, survived the tough. Coach, tell us a little bit about yourself and how long you've been coaching basketball. This is my third year at Lebec Community College. Uh, I've been coaching off and on for about six, seven years. I've been at Fort Hayes State as a graduate assistant uh, for a couple of years. And coached at Cali County Community College where I played ball at. Uh, also coached at Hill Junior College in Texas for a year also. So played uh, played my JUCO ball at Cali and then also played at Fort Hayes State after that. All right, Coach, and let's get right into it. You all beat Ellsworth Community College with a buzzer beater. Tell us how the emotions are going on in the locker room right now. <laughs> it was a pr pretty excited locker room. It, it was, and, and deservedly so. Uh, you know, being down 18, 20 points, and you know, just just fighting and never giving up is a testament to the guys. And we're definitely going to enjoy this one for a little bit. Uh, and, and like I said, they deserve it. All the credit goes to them. They made all the plays down the stretch, and then obviously the big three pointer at the end of the game. But you know, this is the second year in a row we've had a uh, we've had a buzzer beater in the same classic. So I don't know if they're going to uh, invite us back next year or not. But but we're we're definitely going to take this. And credit to Ellsworth, too. They're a really good team. And golly, they had a, a couple guys that just kept hitting shot after shot after shot and made it a tough matchup for us. Explain your team's strategy tonight. Well, uh, <laughs> to hold them to as few amount of points as possible, and that, that didn't work very well. And then at the end, we just tried to survive. And, uh, you know, we, we put on a full court press there towards the end, and uh, fortunately, we made some plays, and they had a couple of turnovers and missed free throws that, 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 that enabled us to come back and get the win. But the, the game plan kind of went out the window when we went down by 20 points. And, and like I said, we, we did pr uh, you know, step up our pressure a little bit. And, uh, you know, we, we've been we've been in a situation before. We have never come back with this many points when we're down. But uh, you know, I, I think it's those early lessons that helped us out. Okay, great. Aside from the Thanksgiving basketball classic, what are some of your team goals compared to last year? You know, they're, they're really similar. You know, we really don't make a whole lot of goals until you know until we get a little bit further down in the season. You know, we just want to get better every day. Uh, you know, basically keep it simple. Um, you know, the goals and stuff like that. You know, we'll talk about that a little bit further. You know, as we get closer to conference time and all that. But just to get better and to keep working. You know, we got you know, obviously in junior college, you have so many new guys, and you, you just want to bond and get everybody together on the same page. So that's really our, our, our number one goal is to just keep buying in every day continue to work harder every day and hopefully the rewards will take care of themselves. Any competition you're looking forward to this season, Coach? Everybody, everybody. You know, I think everybody on our schedule is a good opportunity for us to get better. And, and like I said, to see where we're at as a team. Uh, but you know, we're playing obviously one of the toughest conferences in the country, and, and every every game is a, is a war once we get conference time. So, you know, you know we just want to get better every day. And who who's the next uh, team up? Guys, challenge. Uh, we have, we we play friends. Uh, we play friends on uh, actually uh, Monday, and so we, we don't get a whole lot of time to enjoy this. We play friends uh, JV on Monday. And then we play Wentworth Military on Saturday, and then we close out the uh, the, the uh, first semester with uh, practice. All right, coach. Any shout outs? My family. <laughs> they they came up here to support me, and uh, you know, really really happy. Uh, that they're here and all the support that they provide and obviously the players. You know, I mean, what are we coaches without players? Enough said, Coach. Well, you heard it first from Lebec Community College Head Coach Jonathan Rainey, where Cascade Sports is the home of the student athlete. Check out more videos on CascadeSports.tv. What's up, Kansas City? I'm Brianna Garlington. I'm Charles Williams. And I'm Derek Parker. And we are CMG. And we would like to welcome you to follow both websites. That's what's up KansasCity.net and CascadeSports.tv. Some of our programs consist of Are You Awoke, Coach's Corner, and many more interviews, news, and blogs. Be sure to like our Facebook page and follow us on Instagram at Cascade Media Group and Twitter at What's Up KC and Cascade Sports. And remember, the victory we call success goes, goes to the best, best prepared. prepared. And when you invest in your community, you, you are really just investing, investing in, in yourself. So don't just like it, share, share it. it.